Hemochromatosis is an inherited disease that's found in those of a northern European ancestry. It causes excessive iron overload in the blood, with that iron being deposited in the liver principally, but also in the heart and the pancreas, causing chronic disease. In those of northern European ancestry, uh, the gene mutation, which is called HFE, uh, is found in approximately one in seven individuals. To have uh, this disease transmitted through generations, both parents need to carry the mutation, so the incidence rate is about one in 200, uh, which makes it one of the most common genetic diseases. If it's not detected early, significant iron overload can cause uh, serious liver damage and ultimately um, damage to the heart muscle and also the pancreas. Damage to the liver includes scarring of the liver, which ultimately results in cirrhosis um, and liver cancer if not treated. Our research was um, associated with investigating um, the incidence of arthritis um, in patients with hemochromatosis, another serious complication of the disease. And we found that um, in patients with advanced fibrosis, 85% of those patients also had arthritis. Conversely, in those patients who don't have arthritis, only about 5% had advanced fibrosis. That's not been shown before. It's very significant. It's a particular relevance to people with hemochromatosis. If they have arthritis, uh, then there's a very good chance that they may have serious liver disease or they may be monitored for the development of serious liver disease. And if they can be detected early enough, that liver disease can be controlled very well. The treatment is very simple. It's simple blood donation until the levels of iron in your blood um, decrease. Generally, if you have hemochromatosis and you have arthritis, then you need to be assessed for liver disease.